Ulcerative colitis and Crohn's disease, real cause of IBD, inflammatory bowel disease. IBD or inflammatory bowel disease, is a serious gastrointestinal condition in which part or all of the digestive tract is in a state of constant inflammation. Chronic inflammatory bowel disease is no joke. Two defined IBDs are Crohn's disease and ulcerative colitis. Symptoms of IBD include Loss of appetite Rectal bleeding Bloating Constipation Intestinal cramps Diarrhea Fever Fatigue Erratic menses And night sweats more than simple occasional indigestion or stomach ache, IBD doesn't go away in a short time by itself. Researchers have become interested and concerned about the steady increase in the incidence of this type of disease. There seems to be no one definitive cause but chronic inflammatory bowel disease is the product of several factors, including Diet Environmental toxins Genetics Immune system dysfunction an intestinal bacteria imbalance. How diet affects IBD. In the industrial world, the convenience of packaged foods has become such that we rely on them for the bulk of our diets. What's in these foods is a primary concern. Food additives include preservatives, emulsifiers, artificial colors, flavorings, and sweeteners, refined sugar, and synthetic vitamins and minerals. At a more basic level are the actual food ingredients, like wheat and dairy. Many of these contain genetically modified organisms GMO, and are raised using toxic pesticides. GMO interfere with the balance of bacteria in the digestive system. A GMO of particular note is the raising of crops using Bt Bacillus thuringiensis. Bt is a bacterium naturally found in soil that is toxic to insects. Agricultural chemical companies have crossed this bacterium with food crop seeds so that the plants grown contain this bacterium in their very DNA. The idea is that if the plant resists harmful insects, there's no need to spray additional insecticide, which we know can be harmful. What the bacteria do when humans digest them is even worse. Bt produces spores that are comprised of crystalline proteins. When an insect eats the bacterium, these proteins attach to and erode the linings of the digestive system, forming holes. When undigested food and waste products spread throughout the body, the insect dies. When humans eat GMO that contains Bt, the same thing happens. Not only that, mammals recognize Bt bacteria as harmful and produce antibodies to kill it. So do insects. History has shown that spraying Bt insecticides on plants forces the feeders to build up a resistance to it. Regularly eating GMO foods containing Bt, including corn and soy, keeps the intestines in overdrive, trying to rid themselves of the toxin, thereby causing chronic inflammation. In addition, Bt enters the bloodstream with direct impact to the whole body. It has even been found in the blood of fetuses, passed from their mothers and in animals fed GMO corn. Because Bt are living organisms, they will remain in your body for as long as it remains a hospitable environment. The link between Bt GMO foods and the rise in the numbers of people with IBD is hardly coincidental. Even if a plant is not genetically modified, commercially grown crops are sprayed with insecticides and herbicides, the most common of which is Roundup, its active ingredient is glyphosate. This toxic chemical has been associated with leaky gut syndrome along with a slew of other health concerns, including cancer. Processed food additives contribute to IBD. Emulsifiers are added to packaged foods to enhance texture and increase shelf life. Commonly used emulsifiers polysorbate 80 and carboxymethylcellulose have been found to cause intestinal inflammation and obesity in mice. They have been found to cause colorectal cancer and metabolic syndrome as well healing your gut the alternatives to promote a healthy gut reducing the risk of chronic inflammatory bowel disease and other digestive disorders eat organic avoid or eliminate processed foods increase probiotic intake drink plenty of filtered water plus don't forget to manage your stress levels and get enough sleep and exercise subscribe to our channel by clicking the link below Visit dailyhealthpost.com slash gut healing foods to download a free cheat sheet of the best gut healing foods and the worst.